Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Your back dress, Yabo Ojo turns down popular comedian and says her daughter can never marry a married man. As you all know, this time Yabo Ojo does not joke with her kids. Yabo Ojo has two kids, Priscilla Ojo and Festus Ojo. Yabo got married at the age of 21. This was in 1999 when she had her first child, Festus Ojo. And then in the year 2001, that was when she had a second child, Priscilla Ajoke Ojo. Priscilla is among the celebrity kids who are doing quite well for themselves. Over time, she has been rated to be amongst the most popular and influential celebrity kids in Nigeria. She graduated from Lagos Secondary School in 2016. In 2017, she proceeded to University of Babcock in Elysium, part of Ogun State, and then graduated from Babcock University just last year where she studied media and theater arts. And of course, the proud mother and daughter shared this on the official social media platform. Yabo Ojo has a very close relationship with her daughter and usually refers to her as her bestie. And apart from her successful acting career, Yabo runs her businesses, which she named after her kids, Festus Ojo and Priscilla Ojo. The name of the business is First Priest Limited. First Priest consists of Abela Sports, Lounge and Bar and other subsidiaries. At the bar, this is where she hosts the karaoke night on Sundays. And this past karaoke night, just yesterday, they had a karaoke and comedy night with a popular comedian, Akuru. And during this comedy night, the comedian asked after Yabo Ojo's daughter, Priscilla. And Yabo Ojo could be heard saying Priscilla is around. And the comedian asked if Priscilla was there at a karaoke night. Yabo replied and said her daughter was at home. And the man with an unsatisfied look replied her by saying, Doing what? The crowd then burst into laughter while Yabo said her daughter was relaxing at home. He then proceeded to say you didn't tell her that the love of her life was coming. Yabo then said, Where is the love? You're a married man. And this appeared to spark a poor reply then said, Oh, I'm a married man. Yabo was unperturbed as she repeated and added a born again married man. Akuro then chipped in and said, oh, are you the one who is going to tell me how to serve God? But then the actress backed the point up with, you have the fear of God. Akuro could be here saying, leave the fear. Me and God will settle it later. What is your daughter doing at home? And the crowd could be heard saying she's sleeping. Akuro then continued and could be heard asking again when they're going to have the next comedy night so that it could come around. The crowd answered again that it was going to be on Sunday on the 13th. What well, the disappointed comedian then said he was not going to be around. But before he could talk again, Yabo loudly said, my daughter cannot marry or date a married man. Apo insisted that they will start from dating, not marriage outrightly. Well, this packed Yabo to quickly pray and said, every destiny waster, I reject them. The crowd then responded with a resounding amen. Akuro unconvinced that the destiny wasters are good spenders as they start with one house rent. But the actress was quick to add that Akuro could rather date her or even marry her, but not her daughter. Well, many Nigerians are reacting to this differently. While some are praising Yabo Ojo for being a good mother, while some are also, whilst others are just having a good laugh. The 44 years old actress Yabo has done quite well for herself in the movie industry and also. In her businesses and her daughter Priscilla is doing quite of herself as earlier mentioned. In the year 2021, Yaba Adela joked about believing in early marriages as an African mother and joking with her daughter and others in an Instagram video. She said she wants her daughter engaged at the age of 23, married at the age of 24 and deliver her first baby at the age of 25. Yaba is a single mother. If you want to know more about this Tayyub actress, Yabojo, please stay with us. This Tayyub actress is originally from Abogota part of Ogun State. She was born to Ulubumi Fetuga and Adekunle Ogunru. She has always been involved in drama right from her childhood days. And in secondary school, she was a member of the drama group. She continued with this until she officially joined the entertainment industry. It was in the year 1998 that Yabo joined the movie industry and registered with the Actors Guild of Nigeria, AGN, through a renowned actress, Bimbo Akintola. That same year, she made her debut in an English-language film, Satanic. Then in 2002, she debuted in the Yoruba-language film, Baba Dari Jumo. Subsequently, she started producing movies. 
She made her debut movie production with Bulutifer in 2004, and since then she has produced several other movies, including Silence, Wufe Boko, Ululufe, Esan, and Beyond Disability. Some of the movies she has featured on over the years include Satanic Agogo Ide, Babada Riji on 36 Kino, Inu Obire, Orelari Kwesije, Bamiku, Odumbaku, Ulubari, Egun, Tawo Tawo, Okunyaye, Okonla, Silence, Beyond Disability, Awusa, Trust, Ore, Ipadabo, Twisted Twin, Cause Trouble, Guns America, and Divorce Not Allowed. As Anna mentioned, she is also an entrepreneur who has channeled her energy into several businesses. In the year 2017, she launched the First Breeze Limited. First Breeze is a group of businesses which include restaurants, academy, lounge, beauty salon, and so much more. The restaurant arm um, was named First Breeze of Bula Sports. This is a place where she sells Amala and all the local dishes. Also, at First Breeze World, she runs a spa, makeup studio, selling of beauty products, event management, and ushering services. The lounge and bar arm. Um, have different activities that entertain visitors, including this karaoke night. First Beast production caters for film distribution, film production, and training aspiring actors and actresses. Apart from all this, she is also a philanthropist. In 2011, she launched the Sexy Pinkies Foundation. According to her, it was established with the aim of bringing women together, irrespective of their age or social class. However, due to public misconception on the members being lesbians, the name was changed to Pinky's Foundation 2014. Today, through Pinky's Foundation, Yaba and other women share ideas on different aspects of life and also cater for children with special needs and disabilities. In 2014, the foundation visited the Institute of the Blind. In 2050, they donated gifts to the Family Vocational Institute for Disabled in Njoko, part of Oko State. And in 2016, the foundation staged to work against children's cancer in Lagos. Pinky's Foundation has done several philanthropic activities while also raising a banner for children and women. In 2014, her movie Silence won the Best Movie of the Year Award at the Best of Nollywood Awards. She also has her own personal awards. Some of them include the Best Crossover Actress, Africa Film Awards UK 2007. Over the years, Iabo Ojo has trued many people with her acting skills and she's currently even referred to as the Queen of TikTok Nigeria. So this is a little bit about the style of actress Yabojo. We have come to the end of this episode. But your actress Yabojo says that a daughter cannot marry a married man. And some Nigerians react to this. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.